Hey guys. Hi everyone. So it is day four of our cruise this morning. Um, Afternoon. Afternoon. <laughs> We've decided to have a lion for the first time in like where we're up to so far into this two week and a bit holiday. Um, we just needed it. We had really good fun last night at the adults only club night bit. At, um, at the solarium so it was time for us to rest up a little bit so we've not gone down for breakfast today absolutely and i vowed to myself i'm gonna drink nothing but soft drinks and water until three o'clock today that's just a number i put out of the air but my body really needs it um we're also taking a bit of a risk here because the cleaning balconies around us and ours has already been done but i don't know if we're gonna get hit with some residual balcony yeah. water yeah if you see us suddenly get jet streamed yeah yeah that'll be, that'll be fun <laughs> so yeah we're gonna go to the windjabber to get some lunch and then we actually don't have a plan afterwards i'm thinking i'd like to have a go with the like mini golf up on the top of the ship we'll see because it's not it's quite cloudy today yeah this is uh this is la spezia for those who are interested it is a industrial port as you can tell there's many shipping containers everywhere yeah, so let's go get some lunch. It is Wednesday, my dudes. <laughs> First course for us is going to be bacon cheeseburger with some mac and cheese, and then Laura's got the same again with some additional nachos with chili beef and queso. Very excited. There's so much on offer today. I know, we want everything. This is the view we've got from the Windjammer. It looks very pretty. So when you enter the Windjammer there are sinks here to wash your hands before you start your food adventure, some drinks, healthy starters, so it's, it's all sort of grouped off into different types of food that you can get. We've got some Mediterranean style food, we've got your hams and cheeses, salad, lighter sort of food. We have the Americana which is like hot dogs, burgers, mac and cheese, chips. This is the hot bowl where there's the heaters today of different side accompaniments just here as well. There is the market carvery and they will carve different meat each day. This is at lunchtime and it is chicken at the moment. There are also international flavour section which is mainly the curries. And then accompaniments again like naan bread and papadums. The condiments on this side you get all your different sauces and bowls and cutlery. And there's also this fun spoon wall. There's also a champagne bar and the waiters do come round as well and they do ask if you want any drinks. So this is just an overview of one side of the restaurant and then it's duplicated to the other side. Hello Dave. Massive. Okay, so we must be very quick here. We're melting! We got ice creams! We got one's, free soft serve. One's vanilla, one's vanilla and chocolate. We gotta be quick because it's hot and it's melting, but this is earlier. Alright, so this is the crazy golf that you can do. Um, we're gonna try and do it now just while it's the sun is behind the clouds and hopefully I will win many points against Laura. I've not played for ages, little crazy golf, so we'll see how it goes. Okay, so we're on the second hole. That first hole didn't go very well. I think I was on like seven or something there. I'm going to dink and get through this boat. No. <laughs> well, good try, good try. Blame these cup holders. I'm going to say the cup holders are to blame as well. Here we go, Laura. I'm halted. <laughs> <laughs> Not keeping score. No one was a winner, no one was a loser. This course looks a bit fun with the seal. Good shot. Okay. Okay, not bad. Not bad. Here's Laura to draw the hole. Oh, it's heartbreaking. It's still in it. It's heartbreaking. You should have took yours out. It's heartbreaking. I think that counts. Okay, so this one has like you gotta get it through the shell. And then there's like a little pinball thing here on the other side before it gets to the hole. But she's took she's took the drinks holder behind a Look at the bloody at Tiger Woods now. Hey. All I needed. Yeah. All I needed. I'm, I'm great now. Mm. Oh, no. I'm oh, no. <laughs> it's worse than before. <laughs> okay, let's see if Dane has any better luck than I did. Did you do it? He's coming. Hey. Close. So I come into the schooner bar and we've both got a tropical sidecar, which is my absolute favourite cocktail now. And we're going to do some trivia. Starts at five, so we've got about ten minutes to get psyched up. 
Do you know what type of trivia it is? Is it just like general knowledge, this one? I think it's general. When I looked at the read-up, it said um, you may need to know what's the collective group of, a, of parrots or who said who was credited with saying hello, but that was the right one. So sounds it might sounds help, general, doesn't it? Yeah. yeah. So, just a little bit of afternoon trivia. 8 out of 15 in total. Not a winning score, but not bad. The most interesting one, number one. The original name of Google's search engine was Backrub. I also like that a group of pandas is called an embarrassment. An that embarrassment was of pandas, favorite. that's funny, isn't it? Yeah. So we've just been chatting for a little bit and we've decided that Schooner Bar is the bar that we tend to gravitate towards to a little more and we're, we're really enjoying it here. Yeah, my favourite cocktails in here, which is the Tropical Sidecar, and has been having them as well. They do a trivia, they've got live music on, it's a chill atmosphere, they've got really nice staff, they've got really nice chairs. What can you want? So we've just got back into the room and Jeffrey's made us a new towel animal. He's so cute. I think it's either a bear or a cat. I love it. Oh, I love it. Thanks, Jeffrey. And tonight is another themed night. Can you guess what theme night it is from the shirts on the wall? Answers on a postcard. Or in the comments. You know, one of the two. All right, so as uh, we finally leave the industrial port of La Spezia, we are off to Caribbean night. Looks like they're going to have some really good entertainment on the promenade, and we're dressed in our Hawaiian shirts, ready for the occasion, all matchy matchy. Yeah, it's going to be it's it's going to be awesome. Uh, apparently, there's some dancing on the promenade at quarter past ten. We're going to get some food at Johnny Rockets, which is uh, really exciting because breakfast is awesome. So yeah, that's good. So I imagine the burgers are going to be as good, or if not better. Yeah, and then we'll see what else happens. <laughs> shows in the background so we're trying not to watch it because we got that another day and this is the menu so you can choose two sides a main and then a dessert and then you have a limited drink from the soda fountain or else they'll go and get you a cocktail or any drink if you've got the the deluxe drinks package from over at playmakers just across the road so that's pretty cool laura got talked into a bucket cranberry and then i said the same because i don't know how to think <laughs> drinks existed so I was like yeah I'm happy for the recommendation. <laughs> so our waiters just brought out this beautiful napkin flower. We won't focus obviously. There we go. So our waiters just brought out this beautiful napkin flower. Oh. And a bunch of sauce. Lots of sauce. <laughs> so we've just finished our meal at Johnny Rockets. Tell you a little bit more about that in just a second. But this is the people leaving So I've got some clips of the food that we had at Johnny Rockets, but it was so loud from the Hero Show, I thought we'd tell you about it after the meal. Yeah, so it was really good. Uh, the burger was fantastic. Uh, the chips were really well done. The chilli cheese fries that Laura got was great. Cheese on top as opposed to cheese sauce, which I wasn't expecting. No, I wasn't. I do prefer the, um, I do prefer cheese sauce, but it worked. It mixed it together and made it sort of gooey. Yeah, my bacon cheese fries did come with uh, cheese sauce as opposed to kind of grated cheese. But it was all really it was all really good. The Sunday and the apple pie were good as well, but I was just so full by the end of it. It was so filling. Really was a, such a mm. filling meal. Sorry, just manoeuvring via I don't know what you call these, the corridors. Yeah, so now we're gonna go and see what's happening on the promenade, but we definitely recommend uh, Johnny Rockets for our dinner. So we're trying to find the weight on this ship. So we've joined the Be 
the other ship we were in. Um, we've never experienced being first time cruising, but this is the first time day four that we've experienced it. It's pretty weird. Yeah, I feel like I'm like. Yeah, so uh, <laughs> I mean, we've got some knowledge of tablets, so. It's worth coming to the west. I don't feel like it's going to come to that, it's just we, we are noticing it. This uh, Long Island iced tea, I'm not sure what it's called. This is called the Boston Iced Tea Party. Yeah, this is definitely the strongest drink on the The cocktail, the strongest cocktail on the It's crazy. Very good. Okay, so we've come back up to the room for the evening. I think we just had too much food. Johnny Rockets, you're a, a wonderful restaurant and your portions are brilliant size, so now we've been defeated. Yes. Yeah, we're gonna. Well, it's not that early, it's no, like it's... pretty much midnight. Yeah, going on for midnight, so early for us, but not too bad. But that should mean that we get an early start tomorrow, so that's good. Yeah, so if you have liked the video, guys, please do feel free to give us a big thumbs up. And do subscribe to the channel for our future videos as well. Thanks for tuning in, guys. Thanks for watching. Bye. Bye.